Happy Memorial Day, everybody. I hope you're having a blessed day. I just got out of the shower. I have on a towel, so I'm not standing here naked. Um, Marcus and I are getting ready to run out to go look at some countertop and tile for our kitchen. Um, so I'm just gonna put a little bit of something on my face. So I thought, why don't y'all get ready with me? What? feel like fussing with my hair today so I did a little a wrap on my head I actually just filmed when I was doing this uh, um, a quick three easy ways to wear a head wrap mm, I keep getting blurry here we go there you go three easy ways to do a head wrap it's still acting funky donkey there we go <laughs> Um, and that'll go up sometime in the month of June. I'll put that up. But I did three different ways to wrap. And so this is the one that I wear today. It's a little crooked. but Because <clears throat> this one is uh, more forgiving to the fact that my hair is just out in the afro. Alright, so Big Marcus is dressing Sai. Kai is still asleep. But I'm going to get an outfit out for him. And then we're going to get up out of here. Okay, so we are in the floor tiling place and we originally were coming here to look at this. It's like um, a fake tile that has, it has grout lines, but the grout lines are actually like a plastic. Um, and they feel, the, everything feels like tile. There's, they're not um, bendy or anything like that and it installs like a tile. <clears throat> but then I asked the sales guy what other suggestions he had and he suggested this which is it's a vinyl oh, no no it was this it's still a vinyl he suggested this is called hey, h2o hey. oh but this one isn't water is it still water resistant it, it, it says watertight but this one yeah. hmm yeah it's probably different these feel different so they're imagine. a little bit different yeah they're a little bit different this is so this, this is, is what we're looking at this one's more rigid yeah and um yeah it's like you could almost some of these you could almost put like a they don't have a marking this is harder yeah this is harder this is harder this this line is more i'm just recording oh, my oh, stuff this, go ahead uh -huh. this one is um more this is another line that we have that's more similar to this one here oh okay so i don't have the full planks but i could order you bigger samples if you guys get a, a good idea of something you like in here. okay okay so we left the store but as i was saying in there the original flooring that we were looking at um, was a tile and was going to have grout lines um, where the flooring that we're looking at now is like a click uh, uh, what do you call it? Slide and click? Marcus! What do you call it? <laughs> Snap and click? Like snick, you know what I'm talking about. It clicks in. Um, that's what we're looking at now. It's a, a waterproof and um, it's resistant to scratches and it'll be easier for me to clean so um we actually were able to take a sample plank home to be able to look at it even though we might not really get be able to get a true true feel for it because we're going to be painting our cabinets as well as getting new countertop and backsplash but still i think it'll be nice just to be able to see it in the space i think it's really going to open up our kitchen a lot because we used such dark colors before and kind of just just made our kitchen look so dark but um 
So the only other store since it's Memorial Day that we realize will probably open is Home Depot and Lowe's. So we're about to go to Home Depot and then we're gonna run back home really quickly so that I can press record on Roots that is showing on, um, is it A&E or History? History Channel. So I'm excited that they did a remake of Roots. Um, my girlfriend, Brisha, she went to the screening of the first, um, uh, I don't know what you want to call it because it's not an episode, but the first installment of it, she said it's amazing. So um, I think it'll be a great introduction for little Marcus, for him to be able to see, even though I wouldn't say Roots is the end all of telling the story of slavery for African Americans, but I feel like because they have such a good storyline, it'll be kind of interesting enough for his age since he's almost seven for him to follow and for him to also kind of understand what it meant to have your family completely snatched away from you and been taken to a foreign land and having all of your freedom taken away from you for him to get a better understanding of uh, what slavery is <clears throat> i mean they i don't his school is not that his school ignores it they're not like that like some schools do and just try to call slaves workers um, but, uh, you know, they are very, they're still very soft handed with it. And so I think this would be a great way to kind of truly introduce him to that concept. Dude, can't wait until we get a suburban and all three of these little bastards are going to go home. Bro, they are wild. Wild. Like privacy. <laughs> We're going to have a partition. Yes. <laughs> Just roll it up. I don't even know if it, I might be visible so I can't even see back here. Just <laughs> tune in on a little monitor when I need to. It's like, all right, they good. <laughs> These boys are setting it off. You, I need to find something that will allow this to sit like that. It's called Velcro. Oh my God, why is my husband a genius? Why ha It's game changers, what he just said, what he just said Velcro. I could easily install that and just put a strip on either side of my camera and then the strip right there. Game over. So, this smell always reminds me of when we first moved into the house. We were in Home Depot so much when we first moved in. I mean, literally, four or five times a week we were in Home Depot for the first few months. We don't need nothing, man, another cooler. Yeah, we do. We've got three coolers. <laughs> uh, I don't even, is it wood? What is the smell that we're smelling? Man. I knew you were gonna say it. I knew it. You said man, S-H-I-T. How you feeling today, sir? Good. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> so cute. So Marcus is getting some light to replace the light that's out in our kitchen. And then we're gonna look at some backsplash. It's so uh, countertops. We got the cheapest form of countertop that was probably hot in the 70s. That's what we got down right now, and it needs to go. Why are you mad? Yep. I now have the baby that throws a tantrum in the store. I'm the one. I'm the one with that child in the store yelling, but I don't. I don't even care. So we are getting our lunch slash dinner from the mall, and we went in. We got stone oven in these bags. I got turkey burgers in another bag, chicken, fried chicken and shrimp in another bag. Uh, it's 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 crazy in these streets. Give it to one of the babies. That's what happens when you wait till 6.30 to eat. <laughs> you just order everything that ain't nailed down. Right, what you want? What you got cooking? Right. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited about eating. Give it to the other baby. Thank you. Oh, it's fine. You turn it in. Um, so you, video. you already know. They love to, to snatch me when I have a song playing in the background. I'm just like, I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. I feel like Remy Ma is probably very serious about her coins. So, anyway, we are going to. <laughs> we got uh, two more quick stops to make. Hell, we need to get gas too. We got to get the stuff from Carlin. And I need bread. And it looks like we need gas. 
Did the baby not get his fry, Marcus? <laughs> he already ate it? Yeah. Oh, okay. All right, let me see my children. Bye. It always feels real good when you're watching the NBA Finals and you're in a commercial. Watch. My commercial is on the NBA Finals. What, 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 what? Get money, get money, get money. Well, I wish. Woo, I look a mess. Oh God, so greasy. Good morning, family. It is Tuesday. I am sitting here watching some YouTube and I'm feeding the babies. It's actually kind of late. We woke up late. Well, I woke up my early, usually early time, which is 6.30 to prepare little Marcus's lunch and breakfast. And then once um, he and Big Marcus left for school, <clears throat> I laid back down with the twins because they were in the bed with me. And we, um, I didn't go to sleep at first. I was, uh, I don't know what I was doing. I think emails or Facebook or something. And then I fell asleep with them and I was like, yeah, we'll go to the gym once I get up. We slept, excuse me, we slept until 9.30. It was beautiful, it was so nice. So they're now eating their breakfast, they're eating some grapefruit and sausage. I know that's the weirdest combo, but they're enjoying it. So, there's sausage and grapefruit. Say good morning, say hi. <laughs> uh, yeah. 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 Guys tearing up his grapefruit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they they really like grapefruit. They were getting so mad at me because it was taking me so long to get the grapefruit peeled and getting them into their chairs, but they are now very happy. <laughs> I'm probably gonna work out from home today because um, Sai has a little bit of a cold and um, I don't like to take them to the gym when they have colds and you're really actually not supposed to but anyway I'm probably gonna do uh, one of these DVDs that I have uh, maybe do two rounds of it while they're asleep then after that it'll be probably time to pick up little Marcus because they're probably not gonna go down until 11 30 12 because they usually are up for two and a half hours before they go down to, for the nap so if they don't go down to 12 that'll be fine i can work out for like 45 minutes take a shower get them up get them dressed and we go get little marcus so that's my day doing laundry right now too so get this house looking like something before my husband gets home i hope y'all are having a blessed tuesday i'll talk to y'all a little later look at this boy why he got grapefruit right by his eye Look like he got a disease. Give me it. You're a mess. You are. You are a mess, but not as much as this one. No, you touch my camera. Mm. I'm gonna rinse y'all off. You didn't eat none of your sausage. You tore your sausage up. You a mess. You a mess. Yeah, mess. <laughs> Say bye bye. <laughs> so the kids are down for their nap. I've been reading a script for an audition that I have to put on tape um, by tomorrow. When you put yourself on tape, that means you record the audition yourself and then you send it to casting. Um, <clears throat> so I've been reading the script. And that's been draining. The script itself has been draining me. And then I realized, oh, I really haven't eaten today. So my girlfriend had given me some goat's yogurt. So it's yogurt made from goat's milk. I know it sounds weird, but I really liked it. It's like Greek yogurt, but kind of heavier. And she got me the blueberry kind. And I have fresh blueberries, so I mixed some um, fresh blueberries in with it. Got this little purple color. So I'm going to eat a little bit of this. And then I'm going to dress the workout. I'm, um, me and Marcus are going to look at Tile after he gets off work and then I'm going to take the, all the kids with me to the gym after that and um, then come home and shower me and him will do the pod podcast and then I'll work on getting myself on tape for this audition with Brisha I need to call her either Brisha or Nora I should be able to do it I'm so tired I shouldn't be that script drained me. Mm. 
What's up, family? I just <laughs> left the nail salon where I get my waxing done. So I just got my eyebrows waxed, my upper lip, my chin. I'm a hairy woman, like I'm not afraid to admit it. I don't even think I have to admit it. You can see the hair when I haven't gotten to wax. So, <clears throat> and then I went and got my nails and my toes done at the same place. They're not actually honestly good at toes and nails, but I just wanted some real easy and basic. So I um, got all of that done. I feel like a woman <laughs> instead of a beast. Now I'm just gonna set my hair. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm gonna um, put, put some gloves on, wash and set my hair so that it can be big and curly tomorrow. Like this just made my day. Like I can't even, I'm so excited about the fact that this happened. And the reason why it happened is because I accidentally hired a babysitter for the day. I don't think I recorded that earlier. My, um, <clears throat> the girls that I use, I had booked them out for the NBC showcase for when I thought I had rehearsals. And for some reason I thought I had a rehearsal this Tuesday. And I, I realized that I didn't, but I forgot to correct it with them. I think I told, you know what I did tell Renee? I didn't tell Jade. So anyway, she showed up to the house and she showed up to work to make money. I was just like, I feel kind of bad because if it was on the opposite end, I would be really pissed. I'd be like, well, no, you had me come out here. So I was like, yeah, I'll just go ahead and have her work and I will do something for myself uh, as my lip, my face breaks out. Somebody told me what to use. I need to look back at that video and figure out what she said. There's something to help the swelling go down. Like for the first two or three days, I get random bumps and then they go away from my face being so irritated from the wax. But anyway, I'm going to either two strand twist this. I am, I'm not even gonna wash it cause it's been washed so many times. I'm just gonna dampen it. That way I am gonna ruin my nails. Yes, two strand twist it and then rod the ends. Oh, this is gonna be cute. I am so excited. Yes. What's up everybody? Hope you're having a glorious yeah. Wednesday. I just picked up my cute little baby. Oh, you know what we got today, Marcus? I got an audition. Yes, okay, so let's run home and get the baby's diaper bag and then we'll get to your audition. We almost forgot again, not this time. So we're just gonna run home, I'm gonna grab the baby's diaper bag and uh, maybe something easy for them to eat and then we're gonna hit the road. I need to give me something to drink. We might need to change your shirt too, but I'll leave y'all in the car while I grab the stuff out the house. So, um, today I haven't vlogged much because I have been busy shooting a lot of stuff um, that's not vlog related. Yeah. It's related to the channel, but it's not vlog related. But um, so my camera was in use in a different way. But um, yeah, I am done shooting all of that stuff for today, so now I can vlog. Um, hopefully the podcast will be going up here soon, and um, yeah, we're gonna get little Marcus to his audition. Okay. We'll talk to you later. Bye. So we're driving home for Marcus's audition and there are no cars in the southbound. Okay, there are two cars going southbound on the 405. So obviously something has happened because there are always cars on the 405. Like the fact there are none. <laughs> you know, more than likely something crazy has happened. Little Marcus's audition literally took all of five minutes and then we got let out right in the middle of traffic. That's why Sai's upset because he doesn't understand why he's still in his car seat. Okay, something's crazy is going on down here. I'll try to show you all if I can when we get a little closer. Oh, but real quick, I have been rocking out to the 90s. I was listening to, um, okay, oh my God, if y'all could see all that traffic down there. Can y'all see that? All that traffic? Like, not the traffic going the same direction as me, but the traffic coming back. It's horrible. But um, I was rocking out to cases. Touch me, tease me, feel me and caress me. Hold on tight and don't let go. Baby, I'm about to explode. Then we did, uh, went to Missy Elliott's Can We Get it Tonight? Got so many things on my mind. That's some of the cars are going. Yeah, they're stuck. Ah, I'm about to see why. No. What? The car that that like that white car that went that way. Uh, yeah, that's not that's not direction <laughs> that we need to go. Well, we need to go that way. 
And then what else did I? We did uh, a little Mary Jane and Method Man. And um, now we're listening to SWV's Love Real. Okay, they released the cars. Be right here. Be right here. Right here. What is wrong? What's wrong? Tell them what's wrong. What's wrong? Say hi. We want to go on the land. It seems as if a car broke down. And the police car just has to be. To to no, we are. Marcus, I know how to get to our house quicker. Six and a half year old. Bless that car, it's hard. And they got a handicap sticker and everything. They just, the car just broke down. Well, thank God for the police in this situation because that's scary. Breaking down the 405 is nothing to be played with. That's really scary. So I'm glad that they got him. All right. Off back to listening to SWV. What's up, family? I hope you're having a glorious Thursday. Stop it. I'm trying to have my breakfast, but I have a child in front of me. Kai. 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 That is being so mean. Just in front of me, yelling. And then that one's up there just making a mess. I don't even know. <laughs> Y'all can barely see it. Say hi. Oh, you want a cherry too? They're eating my cherries. I'm trying to have some eggs, turkey, bacon, and cherries right now. Have a healthy breakfast with some water. Stop hitting me. I have an um, audition today, but I want to go work out first. There's a class at 9.30 that I want to take, which the class will let out at 10.30. And if I take a shower at the gym, um, that would help speed me up because people would already be watching my kids. So I don't have to wrangle them. And then come home and get dressed. I think that's what I'm gonna do. In my eggs, I put, I usually do like spinach and basil and tomatoes and garlic. But I was out of good spinach. My spinach went bad. So I put kale. I'm never. Stop it! Stop! You hear him tell me stop? This is my breakfast. That's being rude. Snotty nose. Don't be rude. Um. So yeah. Um. Uh, the kale is actually tasting pretty good. I wasn't sure how it would be. But the kale instead of the spinach. It's alright. But I have some fresh garlic. Kale. Cherry tomatoes. Red hot pepper. Or red pepper flakes. And a little bit of hot sauce. I would have did egg whites. But we only have four eggs left. And I usually. Ah, stop it. Cook with three egg whites. So I was like I ain't going to leave one egg. So I did. Two. Two whole eggs instead. Here, here's the other part of the chair. Oh my goodness. All right. Let me speed up my day. Bye. So what's up guys? I just finished my workout. So I think what I'm gonna do, it's almost 11 o'clock. I need to head out to my audition by 12. I'm gonna run home, sit in front of the house because I think the babies are about to fall asleep and do my makeup in my car then go pick up the babysitter while she's with me run to the grocery store to get them some milk and then go to my audition my hair just needs to be untwisted which i can also do that in the car and this character is in her 20s so whenever i have to play younger than myself i go a bit lighter on the makeup because i feel like Granted, young people do wear makeup, but I feel like I age myself when I go a little too ham. So I'll do some cover up, make my skin even. Mascara, an eyeliner. Mm. If I do any colors, it'll be like soft pinks. Um, 
and I just wish I had a cute little floral dress. Oh, oh, oh. But I can't think of one right now of a floral dress that I have. I gotta think. It's costuming for your audition is just as important as learning the lines and I cannot think. I think a cute short floral dress would be perfect but I don't like kind of flowy. Huh, let me think about it. Hopefully I'll figure out some. But I am clean. I showered and I'm lotioned. I just have to get some deodorant on which I'll get at the house. Yeah so I think this is all work out and I'll be on time to my audition. And um have time to spare when I get out to go back to the grocery store and get something for, for me to cook for dinner. All right, let me get out of this parking lot and get my butt home. So sometimes when I have auditions, they feel pointless. Like, why did I even audition for this? I'm not right for it. And I try to get those thoughts out of my head because it's just like, you know, bring you to the character and if they love you, then they love you. If they don't, oh well, they're lost. I don't feel like that's what I did today. I feel like I was so confused. <laughs> the script confused me. Um, and we sat and did it differently. Like usually I'm standing or seated in a chair across from a camera and the person's reading by the camera, but instead we were sitting across from each other in a very intimate, like we're so close. So I feel like I needed to be more connected to the script in order to make that audition not seem crappy. But anyway, um, I have another last minute audition for a commercial. So I am about to call Marcus at school, let them know I'm gonna pick him up from school instead of the bus stop because if I wait for him to get on this side of the hill, I'll be late for my audition. And me and all three of the kids are gonna go so that I don't have to fork over a bunch of money to my lovely babysitter. Okay, we're just gonna do these two hours and I'm gonna pay her for those two hours and then I'm gonna do take my kids with me to my audition. I've gotta start saving my points. Yeah, yeah. Hey guys, it's so dark in here. It's like we live in a cave. Our lights is getting darker. Yeah. Y'all notice in the podcast, this last podcast, it was so dark over there, it was ridiculous. My husband doesn't want me to show him because right, yeah. he doesn't want to be on camera. I don't want to be on camera. I just said that. Your nose looks oily. And my whole face is greasy. There, see? It's still greasy. I'm so dirty faced. So y'all, I made it to my commercial audition. I did that. I don't remember the last thing I told y'all, but I when I finally got back home, Marcus got home a little bit after me, then I went grocery shopping uh, into the bank. I'll get in there. I just need to go to the shop. Okay. I gotta go to the give, ATM give us, anyway. Give us one second and we'll close the vlog out in a second. I need to try and get my pre picture. N no. Yeah, that's what you're trying to do. No. Try and catch me off guard. We're talking to them if you All don't right. want them to see you. <laughs> All right, y'all. So now we're about to close out the vlog. How do you feel like you've been doing on your fitness challenge? Actually, I've been eating good. Yeah. Yeah. Um. I ain't been doing no working out. I've been a little sick. You got a little cold. So uh, I'm just trying to get better before I get back to the gym and go ham. I worked out today and I did good and I, my eating got better yesterday. It started at the end of the day before yesterday, and then um, yesterday and today. Like I had went to Chick Fil A and got a salad. Who does that with the 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 only 80 calorie salad dressing they had with the grilled chicken I had water and celery sticks all day <laughs> just lying just lying but uh yeah guys so hope you guys have a great Friday and a great weekend our um vlog will be up on Monday he has not shot his tank talk for Saturday, but you're yes, going to. Oh, yeah, you did. I'm so sorry. I'm going to get that one. edited and up. For no, it looks dark. You need to clean your lens. Look at that. Is that what it is? Probably. Okay. I don't think so, but I'll try it. All right, guys. We love you. I feel All like right, there's fam. something I'm forgetting to tell you, but I'll remember next time.
Y'all be just subscribe, like, and share. I'm just chilling. Okay. You happy with this angle that you're getting on yourself right now? You want me to do it? I don't, it don't matter to me. Oh, look at me cute. <laughs> I got my nails done, y'all. I feel pretty. Man, close this hell. Get this camera <laughs> off my forehead. Tell me what to do. <laughs> like, subscribe, share, comment. All that good stuff. All that good stuff. Make sure y'all um, follow Angel on all 9,000 of her social media outlets. And I'm on uh, Periscope at Big Marcus 2782. Once he takes his before picture, I'll post both of ours on my Instagram. No, you're not. Why not? You're going to post before without posting after of me. Oh, so we're going to wait to do that. Yeah, both. you don't do the before before. The, you show the after. Sometimes you show no, progress. You don't. Yes, you do. No, I ain't showing no progress. <laughs> I might not show after. Wag. Yeah. And we still gotta come up with what we're winning. Alright guys. Good night. Be blessed. Alright family. What's up everybody? Welcome back to that Jake Angel TV.